want to show you how to play Lay Me Down by Sam Smith. If you want letter notes for that, you go to letternoteplayer.com. We have them for you. Let's start with the melody that Sam Smith sings. He starts on a B, B, G sharp A, B, G sharp A, B, 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 A, G sharp A, B, G sharp A, B, 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 E, D sharp, C sharp, D, C sharp, B. He sings like E, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, E, C sharp, E, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, E, F sharp, F sharp, E, A, G sharp, E, A, G sharp, B, B. I'm going to play what I just played without uh, saying it so that you can hear it with the notes. two notes in the right hand, G sharp and B, for the first for the first uh, note there. Instead of just the B, we're going to play a G sharp and a B. Now when we go to right there, we're going to move from this e, e major 7 to an A chord, A, C sharp, E. Coming down to the melody down here to the E F sharp, so you're gonna to have to lift your thumb off of that E. Same thing. He's going all the way down to the C sharp, so just lift your fingers off of the E and the C sharp. same thing and this time again play the two notes G sharp and B in the right hand Right hand. And then we're going to a B chord. 
So that will result to a B, B chord in the cadence there. B, D sharp, F sharp. B major chord. And then the right hand's going to cross under. D, e, e. So you got that B chord. While the left hand's moving. E, E, C sharp. And we're going back to the F sharp minor chord. Put it in E chord. E chord is E G sharp B, but because we're down in this vicinity with the left hand, I'm going to play it with B E G sharp, and then we're going to a B seven without the F sharp. B seven would be B D sharp F sharp A, and I'm just leaving out the F sharp right there. So we're just playing B D sharp A. So we're going. For so let me get into that. chorus. Now here we've got the that E chord with the E in the middle, B, E, G sharp, and then do a C sharp minor, C sharp, E, G sharp, down to the F sharp minor, to the A that we've already got. So it's the same chords that we've done already. seven and then just play an E and a B. It's an E chord kind of because the G sharp will end up right there. But you just play the B and the E in the left hand and let the right hand come into the chord. So that ending of that thing we go to an A chord now to the whole B7. The second verse. Now the second verse, we start using pulsed chords. And then here we're just going to use it. We're, so we're going to start off with an E chord, E, B, B, E, G sharp. And then all I'm going to do is two notes. changes right there, he goes to a up to an F sharp. And it goes all the way to G sharp, B, C sharp. So, so the melody changes right there. And I have that in the letter notes. I have the melody for the second, for the uh, uh, second verse by itself, but here we're doing it with the left hand. So we go in up. To and we end with a B chord right, right there before we go back into the chorus. B. And here we're going to pulse right with the melody there in the second verse chorus. are going to be E chord, B, E, G sharp, to the B chord, B, D sharp, F sharp, and right to the C sharp minor chord. And three pulses, back to, now this is actually a, a B, D sharp, G sharp, kind of a passing chord. Uh, we could call it a G sharp minor chord, but it kind of passes between the, the C, to the F sharp minor chord, three, four pulses, A chord, then back to the E chord. Back to this B7. 
seven. And then we're going to go into this bridge pulse, the, the bridge open fifths. There's a third. And a third. So we're going to have F sharp, C sharp, A and E, D and F sharp. F sharp will get in the in the way. The right hand and the left hand kind of collide when he comes in with the singing. Right, see, I've got a D sharp right there, so so you may just have to play that little pulse with the right hand there, the F sharp part. So we'll get into that. Let's let's start just before it starts up, so we can. Get... to play that you can go so you can play you can hold the note and just play the D or you can go you can you can play that along with it so whatever you want on that because the F sharps collide This time he's going to go up, so you got to be ready. And that time he's going to go to a D, we got a D and an A in the left hand, and then to a B and an F sharp. So this melody. So we go to a B, A, C sharp, B. So here it is. this D and the A in the left hand, and then go to a B7, but all we're going to play is the D sharp, the A, and the B, and then we have the tag, very slowly with feeling, you just hit the, play the chord as you play the melody slowly. are going to go A, B7, E. So just fit the chords. Da, da, de, 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 da, de. So just fit the chords with the melody there. Now right there at the end you're going to have a B7 with an A and your melody is going to have this G sharp. So you want to just fit the chords to the melody and then go to the G sharp in the melody. Sam Smith, lay me down. I hope you enjoy it. <laughs>